Yeah, yeah, nice to meet you as well. Greg, Greg, good day, Greg. Well, well done on the year, guys. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, it was great. Yeah, great. Oh, yeah, thank you. Well, we're up to the People's Choice for Sporting or Active Recreation Moment of the Year. And behind us, this is the Hamilton Old Boys 13th grade team. They are one of the finalists. How do you become a finalist? Well, it was all down to voting. And these gentlemen behind us here, one of the top five polling teams for our moment, or moment, I should say, of 2020. So, gentlemen, congratulations. You are a finalist in this year's awards. I'm going to come over here and have a chat with Matt and Greg, first of all, geez, they're big boys. I don't, I don't remember being that big at that age. What are you feeding these guys, man? <laughs> well, they certainly are big boys. And uh, a couple of times we went on the field, and the opposition were like, "Oh, <laughs> what's going on here?" Um, yes, but a great bunch of lads. They've put in the effort all the way through. Uh, the thing was, we didn't know each other at the start of the year. It was a bit of an eclectic bunch, and we came from all a whole bunch of different clubs. But we just gelled really quickly, and. Uh, yeah, I couldn't be more proud of the boys and what they achieved this year. I was going to say, I know you've done really well in terms of your results, but when you hear we're talking about that, you know, that must be even more special than the, the sporting achievements in a way, given that this year's been so topsy-turvy. Oh, 100%. Like, you know, with the year that we've had, um, with a group of boys coming back, and just, just we wanted to build a culture um, that was deserving of, you know, what, they, what they've achieved. And, hey, they were, they were awesome, and, yeah, we just, we just loved every moment. Yeah, Cheryl, very quickly, you nominated. What was it about this group? that felt you should, they deserve recognition this year? Oh look, they're just um, an amazing bunch of kids um, and and to the parents that are here today, like um, if it wasn't for the parents bringing them here and, and the tough times with COVID. Um, so, and yeah, they're just a real special bunch of kids. So, and they were just super deserving and an absolute pleasure to look after. Thanks very much, uh, Nigel. And it's an absolute privilege to be here at Hamilton Old Boys. And congratulations to you guys, to the uh, the thirteenth grade, to win a championship is special. Not too many people do win championships, and um, I heard there's one thing about this side here, the Hamilton Old Boys thirteenth uh, grade, is that you're a humble team. You're, you're you're good sports, but at the same time you play hard. And so it's fitting that uh, today um, that we present the 2020 Waikato Sport and Acre uh, Sport and Active Recreation Awards talking about this special sporting moment um, for active recreation and sport goes to the Hamilton Old Boys 13th grade rugby side. Well done, boys. well done to you too Cheryl. Thank you. Now you always know when there's a, a pause there's always wait but wait there's more. And we've got to wait that there's more. So, boys, coaches, to Cheryl, and thank you for your support of rugby. Parents, um, what we're going to do now is that we're going to add to this and say that for 2020, the Hamilton Old Boys 13th grade rugby team will go down in history as the team that is the winners of the 2020 Sports People's Choice Sporting and Active Recreation Moment. You are the winners of the award. And now I'm going to give you a trophy which acknowledges that out of all the Waikato region, this team, these coaches, this club and Cheryl have uh, deservedly. So you've got another trophy to take on now. So congratulations. Congratulations. What a fitting way to end the year. It was deliberate, Greg. It oh, was deliberate. <laughs> well. We're totally sure. Did you like the weight was more? Yeah. <laughs> as soon as you said that, I was like, oh, what are we doing here?